Hello everyone, this is Moshe the Electric Israeli and thank you for joining my channel. If you are new, please subscribe and help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all my patrons and those who uh, support my channel. Thank you. Today I want to do this video. It was been on my mind and you know I did some little some reading and all that, so it, it's gonna come out good. About the amazing Tesla software uh, updates. Uh, it's, it, no car company does it. No one, no one, no one, no one does this. And doesn't look like anybody's about to do it anytime soon. And it, it has been around for more than five years uh, since Tesla is, uh, released the first uh, car, the Model S actually in 2012. Um, it, it's been a, an incredible thing. And what I did is I, you know, I smushed them up into five categories, not necessarily individual, each one, because they, I, they'll be, the list will be so long. But to five categories, from five to one, which I, from, in my opinion, what I think is the is the most important one in that order, my order. Let me know if you um, agree, and or you can put some other things if I if I didn't put them in. So let's just get, let's go at it. In number five, I put map maps app lucky hungry suit. I will call it. So uh, the map improvements where you can touch a, a, a specific uh, location and navigate to that, it's incredible. What an incredible thing. The app that you can uh, view a software update and release, um, ignite a software update from, from your app, from your phone. Uh, you can send video to your theater right now. Uh, you can send video link to your theater and watch it, uh, and watch it in the car. Uh, you, op you can open and close the garage door from uh, your app. Uh, an additional uh, Windows control for Model S and Model uh, for Model 3 and Model X. So the app, the map improvement that you can send stuff, the lo feeling lucky and hungry that you can through your navigation find places if you are a tourist and you uh, go somewhere and you don't know where where to where to go to eat and you want to see uh, something, some museum or something, and you can put it on and it can give you a range of of that. That's freaking incredible. Uh, number four, all the media, the, the media, the uh, YouTube, the Spotify, the theater, the karaoke, the, all the games and all that. For I mean, I don't use it that much. Here and there, I may use the, uh, I'll, go, I'll go on the browser. Uh, it's something the kids love it, you know, when you're charging and when you're sitting and waiting for somebody, you can really use it. If you pick up, you pick up your children and, they, you know, you have like a few minutes to wait for them or if you are uh, charging, like I said. So the whole media suit and how it started and where it is now it became a tremendous, tremendous um, a, a capability a, 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 while you're driving, but mostly when you are parking and waiting. So that's great, the whole media uh, uh, capabilities. The, num number three, I put the uh, dash cam slash uh, sentry mode. So it, it was not part of, of, of Tesla uh, car. Uh, my Model 3, a few months after I got it, uh, we got this dash cam when you can put a USB. I put like a, a nice one terabyte, um, uh, you know, hard drive, external hard drive sitting nice in, in the in the uh, uh, in the car, you know, at the at the comp at the compartment, and it's just I never think about it. It just records whatever, and not only it records you uh, in 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 motion, which solved so many uh, mysteries, uh, accidents, uh, harassments, all kinds of things. You saw many videos of that, but also when your car is parked and the sentry mode uh, records anybody who will come will come even close. Uh, to the car, so the entire sentry mode, the entire dash cam. Uh, when you, if you leave your dog, uh, so you know on, on the screen, it's just incredible, incredible uh, uh, capability of the whole dash cam sentry mode um, uh, suit. The next one, number two, it could be number one, but number two is it's my favorite, and because I benefited from it personally, and when I got uh, uh, the uh, range increase, my car when I bought it. Uh, it was a 310 and now it went up to 322. It was only 325, I'm sorry. It was only for the rear wheel drive and now the all wheel drive also got it. They got it to 322. That's freaking awesome. I mean, that, I, I can't get over that. That is really great to have um, the uh, car have more, <laughs> more range after you bought it. That's, that's, that's mind boggling. And number one, and I put it 
lump sum. It's really the autopilot, the autopilot suite, and it's very, very incredible. It's not only the uh, lane keep assist. It's it's not only the um, the uh, 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 you know the cruise control, the adaptive cruise control. It's all uh, the, it's all the safety features. It's 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 the uh, blind spot monitoring. It's the navigate and autopilot. It's now it recognizes uh, uh, stop signs and uh, traffic light if you if if the car sees that you have go through them. It's every it started with little and grew so much. Uh, even if you are not engaged in autopilot at all, it still warns you if you veer left or right, if you step on the on the on the lines, uh, you know, on the sideline or in the middle lane, it uh, alerts you and it actually moves the car back. This whole autopilot. A component it is so gigantic and it, it improves so much that it's really really incredible it's an incredible incredible I can't get over that and if I may I put as a star the full self-drive I mean it's getting there it's getting close to their full full self-drive autonomy you know I made so many videos how not that I'm skeptical about it it's like I, I'm not sure how it's going to actually function how it's going to be with with all the variables, but this is another uh, another time. I, I did make a lot of videos about it. In, it's on my autopilot uh, uh, list on my playlist. You can you can watch many of them there. But I, I think the software update in in categories, it's humongous, humongous. Each category I just named the the maps and the apps and the media and the dash cam and the range and the and the autopilot. All each one of them, it's a whole thing that makes this incredible car more incredible as you own it it's really incredible Le really let me know your thoughts uh put down any anything i missed or you would put on this list in in terms of a category and we can discuss thank you guys for watching give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and consider supporting this channel by becoming a patreon all the links are below and if you order a tesla you can use my link as well and we all win thank you guys I'll see you tomorrow